All right, so if you're like me, you maybe get in over your head a little bit in Tarkov sometimes. Let's go! Let's go! Oh, fuck! Yep, he's left and back. I don't see him, but he's back there. If that sounds like you, and you're looking to make a lot of money, a lot of rubles, real quick, without getting overrun by skinned up chads, oh, fuck, man. then boy, do I have the key for you. Hey guys, and welcome back. Today we're going to be reviewing an often overlooked and underutilized key from the map Interchange, the Object 21WS key card. Now, as always, here's the bottom line up front if you don't want to watch the whole video. If you find the Object 21WS key card, keep it and use it. If you have the opportunity to purchase it for under 2 million rubles, roughly, go ahead and purchase it. Let's review the key card, its contents, and our results. Object 21 is located on the southwestern parking lot of the map interchange. The key unlocks a shipping container full of weapons, modifications, and also has two armor spawns. In order to gain access, the power must be turned on. Now I spent 20 raids oh, compiling yeah. loot in order to see if the Object 21 keycard is worth the investment. Out of 20 raids, I survived 15 times, or 75%. Out of my 15 extracts, I was able to gain access to the loot of Object 21 14 times. The total value of the loot amounted to 4,418,378 rubles. That gives us an average haul of 315,598 rubles. Now obviously these are just numbers, what do they all mean? Here are the pros and cons that you need to know before investing in the Object 21 keycard. Our first and most important pro is the return of investment. After only three successful extracts, I began profiting from the keycard. Although the room doesn't boast the most expensive loot, it almost always has enough items to make the run worth it. During our worst haul, we were still able to make over 210,000 rubles. This massive amount of loot brings us to our second pro, easy survived status. Object 21 has so many items that a player can literally loot it and more often than not immediately run for extract. Time for extract, my boys. Thirdly, to make things even better, Object 21 is often left unlooted and is located in a rather desolate part of Interchange. Out of the 20 raids, the room was looted once prior to my arrival. On every other occasion, if the power was on, I was able to gain access without issue. Now nothing is perfect, so I've created a list of cons you should consider before making this investment. First and foremost is power. The room can't be accessed without it. If the key holder doesn't spawn near the switch, he or she must run across the map or wait until someone else turns it on. Secondly, the room is a tactical nightmare. Although it didn't become a factor in our testing, players accessing Object 21 are forced into an incredibly dangerous position. While accessing the room, the player must jump atop a crate, which provides visibility for roughly 150 meters in almost every direction. Once inside, the player is trapped in a grenade inviting hell. Players must also bring large backpacks as well as a decent sized tactical rig in order to collect all of the loot. The weapons related items often fill a pack quickly. These heavy, bulky items can force an unprepared player to leave loot behind. In addition, the room also features two level 4 trooper armor spawns, which only add to the volume. Finally, the key card only has 15 uses. Although our results almost guarantee a positive return, the limited use may dissuade some players. If a player wishes to use their key card to craft an 11SR key card, then they further reduce its return to only 14 uses. Overall, the Object 21 WS is the sleeper key of interchange. Few players have it, even less use it, and people are afraid to buy it. Looting the room is easy, extracting from the room is easy, and returns are incredible. If you're looking for a way to farm money on Interchange safely, this is your key.